Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Missing Those Lego Robotics. Today's video, what I want to do is take you over to the Cargo Connect board. Where did that come from? Anyway, the models are built and what I want to do is instead of giving you guys a video that just gives you the points, I thought, hey, why not just do a video where I show you how the points are awarded and then show you an example of how that happens. So if you want to see that, stay with me. Hino Lego Robotics. Okay, so again, I've done in the past videos where it just shows you the first LEGO League board, the robot game, and it, I just give you the points, the missions and the points. And I figured, you know what? That's kind of pointless. You get it? Pointless? <laughs> anyway, I thought, why not give you the example of, you know, what the points are worth, but then definitely demonstrate that for you. Now, I'm not going to do all of that at once today. It's just going to be missions one and two. But I thought, hey, why not give you guys the point values and actually how does that look? What does that look like for your team to be able to get those points? So today it's going to be mission number one, your innovative project model, and mission number two, your unused capacity. And then we'll take it in pairs as we go along the robot game board. That thing keeps coming back. That's really weird. So come on with me. Let's go to the board. Okay, everybody, this is mission number one, the innovation project model. So you're going to use those white pieces that came in bag 16. And what you need to do is create a model that is resembling your team's project model, your innovative project model. So whatever your team is doing for your project, you're going to make that model resemble that. And the rules state that this white model needs to be... Um, at least using at least two of your bricks. I think I used eight here. And it needs to be four holes wide at any point. So four holes wide going this way or this way here. And the goal is to put it uh, so that your model is touching somewhere on this Cargo Connect logo. And you will get 20 points if it's either inside or touching that cargo connect circle. So let's go ahead and check this out. I have this program putting it right smack in the middle. And there we go. There's your 20 points. And we'll have this robot come all the way back here to home. So again, you'll get 20 points whether it's completely in that circle or partially in that circle, which is pretty good. That way, you know, you, everybody can get those points regardless um, if it's partially in or all the way in. Okay, mission number two, unused capacity. So you have this blue cargo container here with the hinge. And what you need to do is to get the six pieces. I'll show you what those six pieces are in a second completely inside of the container without any pieces hanging out. So you can see this is completely closed here. So if you have the container completely full and the lid is able to close, you will get 30 points. If it's partially closed, which means the pieces are hanging out, you will only get 20 points. So let me go ahead and show you these pieces here. So there's six pieces here, two of the orange, three of the green pieces here, and this three hole beam right there. So it's going to be very wise for one of the team members that's going to be competing for your robot game to just memorize how to place these items into the container so that it can completely close. But if it doesn't completely close, at least you'll get the 20 points for being partially closed. So this is going to be mission number two your unused capacity. Okay guys, so that's it. Missions one and two, really easy way to get 50 points. I mean that unused capacity, just being able to fill that while somebody else is running a mission, that should be easy 30 points. And then your innovative project model going into that cargo connect circle, that should be an easy 20 points right there. So 50 points right off the bat, so for those of you beginning teams, that's, that, those are two missions that I would definitely say do not miss because those are you know quick and easy way where you really don't have to 
you know, get a lot done with your robot to be able to get that mission done. So be uh, tuning in for missions three and four because I'll be coming that or bringing that to you guys real soon, okay? All right, guys, have fun with this first LEGO League missions. Have fun with Cargo Connect. That's really weird. Are you guys doing that? But anyway, have fun with these missions. And I am Mr. Hino for Mission Hills LEGO Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay guys, take care.